Hi everybody, it's Miss Jenikin. In today's video, we are going to be reviewing numbers one through 10, and we're gonna be practicing numbers one through 20. Okay, so it's a little bit of a change up. We're doing a math video this time. You excited? All right, let's get started. Um, first of all, we are going to look at this number line. Okay, and I'm actually gonna turn my light down a little bit. There we go. So this number line um, shows starting with the number one, okay? And we're going to point and we're gonna say these numbers as we go, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. So this number line always goes from left to right. Whenever we read numbers, it's the same as when we're reading words or the alphabet, we go from left to right. So let's count a little quicker this time and point as we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, we know how to count to ten, but do we know what these numbers mean. Hmm, let's look at this. You might have seen this before at your schools. At my school, we call this a 10 frame, but you also might have heard it called a math rack. And it counts to how many? 10, that's right. Let's point and count so we can be precise. Ready? One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whenever we are counting, we go from left to right, and then we go down to the next line just like when we're reading. Let's count one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten frame. Now, if we are looking at our number line and we're looking at our 10 frame, they both have 10 spots. Here represents the numeral or the number, and this shows how many, the amount. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna count to 10 and we're gonna be adding some counters to our 10 frame. Okay, so as I put them on the 10 frame, you're gonna count along with me and point, okay? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How many counters do I have on this 10 frame? 10, because we can tell because it's full. When a 10 frame is full and there's no empty spaces, we know that the amount, how many is 10, okay? Awesome, let's count one more time as we take them off, but this time we're gonna count backwards from 10, okay? So right now we have 10, ready, 10, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Now, if you're at home, what I'd like you to do is pause the video and get either a piece of paper or a whiteboard and have mom or dad or um, someone you know help you draw this 10 frame or math rack. You can even try to draw it yourselves. We are going to be drawing and writing the numbers one through 10 for this next practice. If you're not at home and you can't do this, practice with us just by writing the numbers with your finger, maybe on your leg or on your arm, like we would do for sight words, okay? All right, I'll let you pause for a second. Hopefully you got your stuff, are you ready? Okay, here we go.
one, two, three, four, five. Now where do we put the six? Do we go here? No, we always go back down and go from left to right. So we stopped at five. What comes after five? Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Now, how do you make the number 10? Did you do it like me? Awesome. Now let's point and count at the numbers in our 10 frame. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Fabulous. Now to finally think about the number 10 and counting from one to 10, we are going to put our fingers up and count to 10. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. We have 10 fingers. So whenever we work with numbers one to 10, you could always use your fingers to help you. They are our natural tools. All right, now we're gonna look at numbers one through 20. Are you ready? Let's get started. All right, now that you are experts on numbers one through 10, now let's point and count to the numbers one through 20. We're still gonna start with number one because when we count things, we always start with one, right? Let's go ahead and start and count our numbers one through 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, what number comes after 10? What number comes after 10? 11, that's right, 11. And what comes after 11? 12, that's this number. And what comes after 12? 13, let's keep counting. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Awesome. Now let's see what numbers 11 through 20 look like on a math rack. Okay, so here we have a 10 frame and then we have another 10 frame. How many 10 frames do we have? Two 10 frames, that's right. We have one 10 frame here, do you see it? And now there's the other one here, one 10 frame, two 10 frames. Let's count one to 10 using our um, counters again. Numbers one through 10, and then we'll start on 11, okay? Here we go. Um, one, two, let me get my little counters here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's our first ten. And now we have even more. So if we start with ten, what would be the next number? Hmm. Think about that for a second. If you start with ten and you say ten, What's gonna be the next thing you say? 10, 11, 12, 
13, 14, 15. Now where do we go? Same thing with our first 10 frame, right? We go here next. After 15 is 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. That's right. Awesome. So here we have our first 10 frame and how many is in this? 10. And then we have 10 more for a total of 20. So if we're counting to 20, we start with one and we count to 10. And then you keep going by saying 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, we're gonna do a little bit more practice here. I am going to start filling in the bottom with more circles and you are going to say how many we have now, okay? So if I were to show you this, how many do we have? 10, that's right. What if I do this? Now, how many do I have? 11, that's right, because 10 and one is 11. How about this? Twelve, that's right. You can get there by saying 10 and then counting on like this, 11, 12. Or you can remember that 10 and two means 12. What if I have this? 13. How can I figure out that this is 13? It's 10 and three. And you can also start by saying 10 because you know that the top is full, so it has to be 10. And then you keep counting 10, 11, 12, 13. Perfect. And then of course, after 13 is 14 because we have four and 10, 14. What do we have here? 15. You can figure out this is 15, how? 10 and five. You could also count by fives by going like this. Five, 10, 15. Hmm. Or you can know that 10, and then you count 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. You can count like that. Now, what if I start going to the next row? How many do I have now? 16, that's right. Because we have 10, five, six, 10, 15, 16. You can just know that it's 10 and six, 16. You could also count by ones after 10, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And then if I keep going, I'll have 17, 18, 19. And how many do I have when I fill up the whole second 10 frame? 20. You can figure out because we have 10 and 10 and that makes 20. Because if I count my 10 fingers and my 10 toes, how many is it? I'll let you count and figure it out. I bet you it's this many. <laughs> 20. All right, next we're gonna do a little bit more of a challenge. Are you ready? 
Okay, here we go. Okay, for our final challenge, I'm gonna show you some cards with 10 frames and amounts on them. And you are gonna see if you can figure out how many there is. Okay, here we go. We'll start with an easy one. How many is this? One, good. Five. Eight. Four. Six. Two. Seven. Three. Okay, we're gonna get a little bit harder now. Are you ready? Oh, that's hard. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Ten and three is 13. Very nice. Ten and two. You might say 10, 11, 12. Oh, what's 10 and one? What's right after 10? 11. 10 and five is 15, 16. You might say 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, or you might just know that 10 and six is 16. Five, 10, 15. Five and 10, 15, 16, 17, 18. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, it looks like all of them are filled in except for the last one. So what is a number that's one less than 20? 19, that's right. All right, before I say goodbye, let's go ahead and count one to 20 one more time. If you'd like to take your shoes and socks off and start with your fingers and then keep going to your toes, you can do that too. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. All right, this has been numbers one through twenty. I hope you learned something. Have a great day.